Tonight is expected to make a full recovery. KMAX Paige Peroso joins us now from Seagraves with more on what happened there last night. Paige? Yeah, one thing everyone told me here in Seagraves is that they were just shocked that it happened here. It's a town of just under 2,500 people, so usually pretty quiet. So when they heard gunshots in their family neighborhood, they were understandably very scared. Now, those neighbors I spoke to, none of them wanted to go on camera with me, but they did say I could tell their story. And they said it was shocking to hear those gunshots. One neighbor said he heard as many as five. And as soon as he heard them, he laid down on the floor, fearful that one could go through his window and hit him. Those gunshots rang out down this block after that officer initiated a traffic stop near the intersection. That's when a suspect shot at the officer and the officer then shooting back at the suspect. Both people were injured in the shooting. Of course, this is developing news. We're expecting an update tomorrow afternoon from the Texas Rangers on exactly who these people are, what happened, and if any charges are being made against that suspect. For now, in Seagraves, I'm Paige Peroso, KMAC News.